Hello everybody and welcome back to another edition of Matchbox Marks Diecast Restoration. So on the roundabout today is my build for the DMC monthly build and the theme is more than four, more than four wheels. So this qualifies with a whopping six and I'm going to start doing the DMC builds every month because the themes I can definitely appreciate. I can normally do most of them. Uh, the only ones I don't like are uh, gas lands, wastelands. Just not a big fan of those and I think I've only done two in about 480 videos. So anyway, but I do like the various themes. So anyway, uh, this is more than four and it's the Matchbox. Alvis Stalwart work? I can't I can never remember it by heart. So Alvis Stalwart. Stalwart. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I do have some wheels. I do think I think I just went to the store and bought O-rings, the same size, which is like the original tire. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with this baby. Um maybe I can go on Google Images and get some ideas and everything. So anyway. All right, folks, so enough of me yammering. Let's get it off the roundabout and take it apart. Stick around. All right, folks, here's my Alvi. I'm going to call it an Alvi. It's easier. So here's the body, here's the chassis, here's the axles, and here's the uh, little hubs. So obviously, I'm going to paint those after I clean them up. So this actually uh, allows me the opportunity to do a uh, two-tone, which is actually really cool. So I'm going to do a two-tone. But I don't know what colors. I don't know if I'm going to put a livery on it or not. I know this is the BP originally. But I'm not going to do BP, so I need to figure it out. All right, folks, stick around. All right, here's an update on my Alvis, my Alvi. And I just wanted to show all the good detail on this thing before I paint it. This is just such a cool uh, casting, such a classic in the Lesney collection. So awesome. I don't know what color scheme I'm going to do, but I'm going to try to do as much detail as I can just to bring out all of the uh, the details. Anyway, once again, no clue what color I'm going with, but uh, hopefully it'll turn out okay. All right, folks, stick around. All right, folks, before we take a look at the final reveal, let's see what I started with. I started with an Alvis Stalwart. Uh, factory, missing some tires, and just beat up. All right, let's see where I ended up. All right, folks, it is time for my reveal for my Alvi stalwart. So I actually thought that the upload for this was today, the 18th, but uh, I already saw that PJ and the team did the recap video today. So I need to go back and check and see when the actual upload date was because on my calendar it's the 18th. But anyway, nonetheless, I missed the recap, but I already commented on the video for the recap. So great jobs, great jobs for everybody who did the more than four wheels. So this is my entry to the DMC build. And I actually got this idea from the one and only Mr. J.B. Weld himself, Jim Silva. So he did one of these a while ago, and I actually Googled images, and I wanted to know what I could do with this because I think it's just such a cool, mean-looking casting. And Jim actually did that, the rapid response. He sent me a sticker. So uh, that was a great turnout, Jim, on that one. Absolutely loved it, and I love the, uh, the wheel swap that he did. And I actually saw this image uh, on Google Images. So um, anyway, I wanted to do a 
kind of like a rescue vehicle too. So this is a fire department rescue vehicle, number 17. Um, I did a lot of detailing on this, like the little uh, hinges for the doors on the side and painted those red. And then the, um, I guess those are escape hatches. I don't know if you go in that way one and only. I don't know, I've never seen one of these in action, but they're so cool. So anyway, uh, thanks to the DMC community for doing this build and I'll try to make it on time next month. So anyway, cheers to everybody. Thanks PJ and the team. And let me know if you like this video or this casting, really. So, all right. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next video. That's all, folks.